guys, Soberly here today and welcome back to Cities Skylines. Today we're going to be working on some more campus stuff finally because it's been like forever since we've really done anything with campus or at least with our liberal arts college that we have here. It is level four, that's pretty good, but we're going to get some more buildings in it. I also want to probably start building a new one as well because for a while we left it and my reason was our population wasn't that high. But now I feel like we've got around 70-ish thousand. We're not really making a bunch of money right now, but that's okay. We've got around 70-ish thousand. We now have like an airport. We've got good train lines. We've got all that kind of stuff going. So I think... We can probably start doing some more of it. I mean, we probably could have done it a while ago too, but I was getting a little carried away with other stuff. So let's have a look at what we actually need to do over in this guy. Uh, so at the moment, it's just the attractiveness holding us back from getting to level five. Everything else is pretty good. We actually have 3,300 students here, which is actually, that's really good, I think. Uh, so I'm quite happy with that. We don't have any policies. Academic works are sort of, I guess, We've got a lot of them. We've got 48. That's pretty good. I guess we don't need to worry about doing more of those, right? Varsity sports. Do we won three, lost three? I mean, I guess we could pump more money into this if we wanted. So hiring more coaching staff increases the chance of winning. So how much does that cost if we start doing this? Uh, it is a thousand per coaching staff. Okay. So let's watch our money drop. If we get six, So if we did 25... Oh my god. <laughs> okay, immediately goes red and then it's going to go like negative 25. Let's, uh, not. Let's go, we can go, we'll go up a little bit. We go to 5,000, that is pushing it a bit. And then let's have a look at some of the buildings that we need to get in this area. So we want the, what do we want? University campus. No, we want uh, liberal arts campus area. Okay. So uh, we have the dormitories and all that. We need some of the more unique stuff. So liberal arts laboratories. Are these, one, uh, one of these buildings? I'm, I'm not sure which buildings uh, we can only do one of now. Because we've obviously got... A bunch of buildings are ready, but I'm not sure which ones are unique and which ones aren't now because it's been so long. I think maybe these ones could be placed multiple times. I'm trying to see, it's hard to see if this is anywhere else. I'm just gonna put that there for now. I don't think so. Well, I guess you know one way we can check is if we can place it. We can place it again, so maybe we do have that. Hmm. Yeah, it's kind of hard to tell. <laughs> I don't know if we've already got that. I don't think so. Uh, you know what? I guess I will... Okay, well, number one, let's level this out a little bit because it's a little bit high up. I'll bring that down. Campus bookstore. No, I'm pretty sure we don't have that. So there you go. That, that sits there quite nicely. Okay, I'm actually quite happy with that. It fills that spot really, really well. So I did want to just expand over this way because we have all this space and I think we're going to need more room anyway. I also don't know if we have these buildings. The or, Do we have the auditorium? Seems like something we would have, but I don't know that we do. I'm going to put it over here. Not on that main road. I'll put it on this sort of road that we got around the high school. So if we have this building, do we have that? Is this just going to be a, a game of me seeing if we have that building or not? I don't think we do. Anyway, I'm going to put that there. Let's get some pathways going over here because currently there's not really an easy way to get over here. Also, there's no water or anything over here, so let's sort that out too. So we're going to go down to here. So we'll probably fill in, but we'll try to fill in this sort of space over here, I think. With, well, we're not just going to place random buildings. If it makes sense, we'll put some more stuff in here and sort of expand the campus around here. Because this is this is a park for the area, which we should probably make a little bit nicer. This is part of the, is this part of the campus area? We should probably make sure it is part of the campus area. That's uh, an important, oh, it is. Okay, all of this is. Okay, good. Uh, so I've already done that. That's good to know. I guess it probably wouldn't let me place a building if it wasn't, right? What else do we have? Uh, com we have the, I know we have the commencement office. Uh, I assume we have a statue somewhere. We'll get another one though, right? Why not? Can we just get another one here? I, mean, I just assume that we already have this. We might not have that though. You know what? I guess... Oh no, I think there. That's it there. Uh, and then... So we've got that building. I don't... Yeah, I don't think we have those buildings we just placed at all, which is good. I do like how busy this area is. It's nice. Okay, anyway, so back to pathways. That's what it's actually doing. Uh, we could do it... They can technically cross through here, but I'm wondering if we do like a pedestrian bridge just because it is quite busy with like trams and all that through the area. So maybe what we'll do is we'll jump into pathways. Uh, we'll just use this regular one here. Come down this way. Turn on anarchy because otherwise it's not going to let me do it. Turn off road guides. There we go. Go to here. Go up to like, I don't know, seven meters. Is that high enough? Yeah, that looks good. I'm going to go across to there. That's good. We'll, le we'll level this all out in a minute. Across to that side of the road. Okay, I did actually still want a column here though. So can we put that back please? Yeah, thanks. And then that'll come down over this side. So then we have a nice like pedestrian uh, crossing, which is good. And all of this will be leveled out to I guess maybe that height. 
That looks fine for me. That looks plenty high enough. Yeah, that's, that's, that's probably actually too high. Let me bring that a bit lower there. As long as those tram wires go underneath and then we can fit like trucks and vans underneath this bit. Uh, hot dog? Ooh, it's close, but it fits. <laughs> it's close. We could go a smidge higher. Maybe I'll go a little bit higher. That should be fine. Okay, so that'll go there. That'll get them access over this side without having to cross through the roundabout, which is probably not ideal for anyone involved. So we're going to get this going through like that. Uh, and then I'm wondering... No, we don't need any other connections on that. That's fine. So that'll go to here. And that'll allow them to get over this side, which should be quite nice without having to, you know, do anything else. All right, so that'll come over here. Now, let's have a look at what other buildings we can get. So I think probably all this stuff I think we already have. So let's go down this way. We need to get to, I guess, level five to get the next stuff. Or is it uh, reach prestigious? Yeah, okay. So we just finished a school year. So it means we're, we're not, we're gonna have to wait a little while till we can level it up again. So we, uh, that's the wrong thing, I want the liberal arts, oh, hang on. Info, so, uh, we didn't get up to 1800 attractiveness, so we just kind of need to do a bunch of stuff. Uh, now, I guess we can just do, well, we can just do more buildings, like, the more of the same buildings we already have will work for that as well. So this will do, uh, I don't know, does it tell me how much attractiveness these things actually do? Because I know they add to it, but I don't know how much. Maybe we just get some more. What if we get another liberal arts outdoor study area? Like, what if we just get this over here somewhere? Because we got a couple of parks by this high school, but maybe we just get this guy. Actually, can I rotate? Let me rotate around this way. So it's sort of facing where the high school is. And I'm going to get this here. So it kind of looks like it's part of the high school, but the idea is it's not going to be. That's not the idea. Uh, anyway, so I'm going to get a pathway here that comes through down this way and then that can come straight up here and then straight down that way that will join through there and then I'm wondering ah oh, it's got a hedge there it's kind of annoying because I kind of wanted to come this way and around which we still can do like the trees will just sort of be in the middle of the pathway I think that's all right and then maybe we can get one through here as well yeah I'm just trying to I just want to make sure it's kind of connected as much as we can make it uh, so they can definitely get over here so that should increase our attractiveness quite nicely too uh, apparently this has student- this adds student capacity to our university for reasons that I don't quite know. Uh, so we are doing okay. Campus area info. Uh, that did not really do anything for us. Not as much as I would have liked it to. Uh, so I guess we just need to do some more buildings. Do parks add stuff or not really? Is it just sort of these buildings? Let's have a look. Supplementary buildings. So that's all these ones we can just keep adding. Then we have faculties, which we can get one more eventually. And then we've got the education buildings. Maybe we want to have a look at these supplementary buildings. Um, increases campus area, campus area attractiveness. So, I mean, we already I know we already have these, but I'm wondering if we just get more of them. What if we just do this one here? Because I think we have that over here somewhere as well. I think that's that building there. So I know we already have them, but it's like maybe if we just add a few more of them over this way, we'll sort of get... I mean, that actually added quite- that added like a hundred just by doing that, so maybe we'll just do some more of this stuff. And uh, then we got- We did the outdoor study, but that didn't really do much. It does increase the attractiveness, apparently. Maybe we get another fountain over here. Oh yeah, right- oh yeah, right in the middle of this, that'd be perfect. Well, maybe not perfect, but we'll see. Um, uh, hmm. It's not really perfect, is it? Okay, let's move that. Let's put that over here somewhere then. Put it there, and then we'll get some pathways around it, and maybe add like... Maybe just add some dorms or something over here too, that'll probably help us out. So we'll go here, and we'll come around, and then I'm obviously gonna have to like, adjust these a little bit. Just to get them to, you know, fit around. A little nicer. There we go. That's fine, yeah, that joins the path. I think they can get off the pathway there, hopefully. It's not exactly right angles, is it? Which would probably be nice if it was. <laughs> uh, that's okay. Go about to there, maybe. Oh, hang on. We almost had it. I mean, the easier way to do this would have just been to build it at right angles to start off with, but... I don't think that's going to happen, so... I mean, it's a roundabout there. That's fine. Okay, so we're going to do that, and then... That should have helped us out a little bit, right? Right? Right, guys? Did that help? We're fine. We're finally doing campus. Okay, that did add 100. All right. Get rid of this, this part, though, that road, because I don't know why that's there. How's this going? That's good. Uh, then we want to do some more, maybe some more dorms or something would be good. How big are the dorm buildings? Let's have a look. So study hall, dormitory. So we could get a few of these around here maybe. Maybe if we go like one, 
I can't really see where the river is in this view, which is slightly annoying, but I was thinking maybe we go one here. And then maybe one on this side somewhere, maybe like one like this behind that building. Oh, whoops. That was, I was meant to place it just then, not, <laughs> not rotate it. So I wanted one on an angle behind this building. Mm hmm. Like that. And then maybe one this way. So you get this little dorm area around here. That's pretty good. And then I think we just get some pathways through here to connect it all up. That'll be quite good. Uh, so let's get this guy. It's going to come straight through to here. Uh, it's going to come down this way. So they've got all these like specific tiled fronts. So I'm trying to line up to those, I guess. That can come straight through this way. Uh, to there. To there. A lot of little... Now, are these bushes in the surrounding area or is that part of this building? That might be part of that building. Which means it's slightly more annoying because that means I'm going to have to move this. Because <laughs> I was hoping that... Yeah. Okay. Well, I can't get that. Hang on. It's okay. I am a professional. So we get those two. Oh, okay, there we go. Now we move them. Okay, let's turn off snapping. That's not helping anyone. <laughs> we move them to about there. And then we just move this one. Oh, hang on. Move this one a little bit further up. Snapping. It's probably about fine there, actually. Yeah, it looks okay. So that comes through the middle of all these, joins back up to that road, and then we definitely want it to join to that bridge, otherwise that bridge is completely pointless. So that will come down and along like that as well. Just join around to this area. Yeah. And then... I guess I should, probably should have just left that. And then we could definitely have a pathway going through here. I think I'll just use it this uh, sort of regular gray looking one, so it just blends in a bit better. So they have a way to walk. Mm-hmm. Okay, so that adds a bunch of dorms just through here. And then I kind of want to do... Whoops. Pathway right here along the side of the building, because it looks like you could definitely have one there. And then I'm thinking this should probably just join more at that angle. Okay, I need to turn off snapping, because it really gets in the way sometimes. That'll go there. Okay. So that should be pretty good. Are you guys, are you guys digging it now? Is everyone at the university having a good time? You know, you're all... Coming to class and being like, yeah, look at all this. We got all these sweet new dorms around the place. I feel like the back of these buildings looks like they need pathways, so that's why I'm sort of adding them in. So it looks kind of weird without it, I guess. Oh, okay, goodbye pathway. It just deleted the whole one. Okay. And now that's all raised up for some reason. <laughs> Let's just go to here and then... Really? That's gonna... Do a bit where it's raised up. Okay. And if we do it that way, it won't. Oh, okay, well that's... hmm, okay. <laughs> Made that, move that up a little bit. Yeah, it's, I mean, it's right on the river here, but whatever, that's fine. Okay, so that looks good. I think that's a nice little area, and then we can get... Uh, well, actually, let's have a look first of all. I should probably slow down time, actually, if we're trying to get this before the next academic year. Uh, let's have a look where that got us to. That did nothing. We're still 1281. I swear that's what it was a second ago. Does this actually... I thought these do contribute to that. Hmm, okay, well... I guess we need other buildings then. All right, so I guess that didn't contribute anything. Uh, increases campus area attractiveness. Hmm. Or not. All right, well, let's just go back to supplementary buildings. These ones seem better. They seem to do like 100. A little, let's do another library, because we definitely we definitely have a library somewhere else. If we don't, then that's really dumb. Oh, yeah, I think it's here. I think that's it. Okay, so that's going to go over here. Maybe we can overlap it with that pathway there. Oh. Well, if it didn't have a hedge in the middle of the pathway, then we could. It's alright, we'll move it over. So this will go here, and then we'll just do a pathway that goes along this section. Alright, so that gets another little section here. That'll go there. Cool. And that could just join up to this road that we have in front, which is fine, I guess. Go to here. Yeah, that's nice. I don't- oh, someone's died. <laughs> it's like, oh yeah, that's nice. Oh, someone's died. Great. Okay, so this whole area is building up a little bit more now, which is really, really nice. Uh, I wonder if we can get anything more back here, maybe. I wa I'm actually kind of wondering... Oh, we've got an art club. I'm wondering how big the... Uh, should we, get an art? we can get an art club in the middle here somewhere, or maybe like over here or around the back over this way. Where, wait, hang on, where's the river? It's like right here. We can get something over here, or we could go... Because we still need to fill in this whole section as well. I'm wondering how big this other faculty is going to be, because I don't think it's going to be small, you know? I think we might have... 
an interesting time with it. We can go like that so we can fill in this section a little bit. Oh yeah, look at all these people coming out of there. I think that train is actually really popular, which is really, really good. Let's get the little art club, which again, we... Is that... Wait, is it the one we have right here? Because if it is the one right here... Oh, it is. Okay, maybe we won't put it there. I don't mind having multiple of these things, but if they're going to be right next to each other, it's going to look really stupid. So let's just get over here by the high school area. Like there, maybe. That's fine. A little building on that road. Okay, that'll go there. And then we can get out a... What's next? What's next? Maybe... Hmm. What's this one? Oh, we already- we did that one- well, I know we already did these buildings. We did them so recently. We don't need another commencement office. We need... Library's always good, but we already got that. Well, I know we already got- of course we already got it. I don't know why I keep saying we've already got this stuff. We got all of this. <laughs> we have all of these things. There's probably a better way to be doing this, and you guys are gonna be like, Why are you doing it that way? And I'll tell you why I'm doing it this way. Because we've not really played with the campus DLC yet. If this is like- this was originally like a campus kind of series. Uh, ooh, that's kind of gross. Let's fix that up. Anyways, we've got another cafeteria over here, which I think would be actually useful because, whoops, if we have more dorms over this side, I think it makes sense to have another cafeteria for these dorm areas, so... I feel like after playing The Sims 4 Discover University, I have a better understanding for campus areas, you know? It's a pretty good campus area, though. Uh, 1456. Okay. Now, let me just see. So we've got 1456. Why don't I actually just test putting regular parks in the area? Like, what do we have here? We got a, a floating cafe. That's pretty... Oh. I was gonna say, that's pretty sick, but it goes really far out. How about we do it, like, here? Oh, we can do it on this key? Hell yeah. If I do that... Oh, does it need a road? Oh. Okay, never mind. <laughs> yeah, actually, that's the problem with these regular parks, isn't it? They're gonna need roads, not just pathways. So if I do this... Let's get a dog... Let's get a dog park here. For reasons that I'm not quite sure. But we got it! Uh, campus area info... Uh, 14? I don't think that did anything. Well, we got a dog park now, that's pretty cool. I mean, this already looks a lot more full than it did, which I'm quite happy about. Like, it was- it's been so empty in that area for so long, and we'll upgrade this park as well, I think. We'll keep working through all this, but... Um, oh no, you got a goods issue. That's not good. Not enough raw materials, even though we've got a, uh, cargo station right here. Which, by the way, is seeing some issues. And I, I, I think I figured out what it was. Because I couldn't fig I couldn't quite figure out why everyone had to go to this cargo station. Because I was having a look at traffic. I know I'm getting completely off track here. But if we have a look at the traffic coming to this cargo station. I'm like, why are they driving all the way across the map just to get to that one? Be especially people coming from down over here. Because we have a cargo station right here. But then I realized if you follow the cargo line. It actually comes around here and it only turns. The cargo line only goes back toward the city. It doesn't join to the region, so anyone shipping cargo to or from here is just shipping it over here. Which is a big problem. So you know what? Now that I've remembered that that, that was a problem, let's actually fix that, because that's pretty bad. Uh, so we've got... Let's get it here. If we just connect this rail around this way, I think that'll be fine. I can pump it out that way. That goes all the way out of here. Well, we probably want to go both ways. We probably want it on that one, and then also this one. So let's have a look. So we're going to go from here, maybe. And I know this is a complete sidestep to what we were just doing, but when when I was looking at the other stuff just then, I re I remembered I remember when I was like looking through stuff. I was like, oh yeah, that's a that's a problem, isn't it? That's gonna go to here, tent bending like that, anarchy, and also let's go stick it on the ground, all that kind of good stuff. And then we'll fix that. Oh, yeah, we'll fix all that in a minute. So I'll go there. Then we also want it to go to that one. Uh, we don't need it to turn left because it already does. So maybe we do that, and then we can also go from here. Uh, turn off snapping. Oh wait, no, I had snapping off. Turn off the grid? No. Okay, it's gonna have to go. Whatever, we'll go there. And then... Snapping back on, and then we're gonna come around. I go to here, but it's gonna keep going past, come up to here, and then join in there. Yeah, okay, now I just gotta fix this up because it looks absolutely atrocious. So that's gonna come- okay, I'm gonna get rid of this power line because it's gonna just constantly get in the way. Alright, now remind me to put that back because I probably will forget and then the whole city will be without power. That's usually how these things go, so we'll have to be careful of that. So it's gonna come around, all like this. I don't think- now, I always wonder how this slope works because... I feel like it's just doing a straight line slope between these two points, not like along the node path, but it's probably fine. I mean, that actually looks pretty good, so I think it's fine. 
Now this one, oh hang on, from here, this one will be a bit more interesting. We might need to change this to like the brick elevator path. Uh, I don't know if we're going to be able to go from much further back because it might intersect with a highway. But let's have a look. So we're going to go slope from here to here. Uh, it does hit the, the this area a little bit. So we want to go a little bit lower through here because otherwise we will bang into the uh, the highway there, which is... Yeah, you know, not ideal for crashing into that. So let's change to this elevator brick one as well, because I'll just make it look a little bit neater as it sort of starts lifting up off the ground. So go like that. Uh, except for this bit. This bit looks awful. That's a bit better, I think. Maybe. I mean, the track still looks messy, but to be honest, I don't know there's much I can do about that. Because it's just how this, these textures connect. All right, so now that one goes here. And now we just join them down over this way, and then we should be good. So we're going to go back to a regular train track over here on the ground. Uh, we've got this one and the other one's back here. So let's just bring them all the way down here. Uh, these are all going to be the same height as that one. So it's going to come through. And this one here can all be the same height as that, I think. Yep. Then we have to move this as well because that's not in a great spot now. Uh, did that have... No, I was going to say, did that have pollution there? It looked like it did for a second, but it doesn't. So we're good. All right. The pipe is just going to go here to here. I don't know. Why do we even have that water tower? I don't know. I don't know why I was so determined on doing water towers everywhere. All right. So now this was connected out to here, which I think potentially powers the entire city. Yeah, because if this isn't connected, then none of this is connected. Yeah, it's, uh, it's a pretty dodgy system we have. I'm, I'm not going to lie, because it's like if we have one power line down, the entire city goes out. So it's, you know, it's delicate, but it's just the way things are here. Oh, that looks weird. Nope, nope. <laughs> Redo that. Oh, I, how did I get here? Where am I? Stop that. Hello? Here we go. Straight across and straight to there. Okay, so let's un... Oh, wait, no, let's not unpause. Uh, let's finish the railways first. <laughs> let's do this first. All right, so this is going to go on the ground. It's going to just curve into here. And then this one just curve into there. It branches off at separate points. Well, actually, hang on. That's pretty dumb. Why would we join them all at this one point here? Hmm. Maybe this one can join from here. Yeah, that'd be better. If we go, oh, nope. This one. And to here. Yeah, so then it sort of just branches off that way. Okay, let's try that. Because now that should mean... We can send cargo from down here to the region instead of them all having to use this one because that's what's happening. They're all having to go here just to send cargo out, which is really stupid. So anyway, now that I fixed that, let's get back over here. <laughs> uh, oh yeah, let's also just check that the power's still good. Everything looks good to me. Beautiful. How are all these random towns going out here, by the way? Should probably get back to those at some point. Oh, you're having good... Yeah, I think we're having... Honestly, I think all the raw materials issues is probably because of the poor cargo transport that we had going on because like this whole area has so much cargo here but or you know or it's maybe this is just glitched i'm not sure but um it's hard to tell also this has crime as per usual and the police station's right here as per usual but anyway whatever back to the back to the campus where was i over here okay how is this going i wonder if we it's 1456 we're pretty close um, if we do... Can you please tell me stuff again? I like when it gives me tool tips. Uh, I was gonna say, if we do... Because that was not helping me. What if we do more varsity sport? Would that help? What is this? Trade school campus... Oh, okay. No, we don't want that. Uh, we want museums, varsity sports. Does this... Uh... Actually, you know what does? Isn't it... If we do the, um... The policies? Don't these do some stuff? Free lunch. Increases student happiness. I want attractiveness. Student health. Hmm. Increases campus attractiveness by 20%. Regardless of the campus's reputation, students don't pay any tuition fees. Well, that's a problem. So no. Uh, <laughs> uh, odds of winning. Increases the amount of visitors. Uh, I just want campus attractiveness that isn't going to cost me a bunch of money. Faculty bonus. Hmm. These just do health. Okay, that doesn't help me. Um, right. Okay, so I'm not sure. Um, and do, do trees help? 
If I just put a bunch of trees in here, will that help attractiveness? <laughs> hey guys, if I just give you trees, will that help? Please. All right, let's go turn that all the way down. We're gonna get way too many of these. Let's go whoop. There we go. Cool, that's doing almost no trees. Maybe a little bit more than that. There you go. A few trees around the place. Some in the park. Some in the fall tree as well. Mm -mm, delicious tree time. Tree time. Got some leafy fall. Seems like it wants to do more of these ones. Then we get leafy tree two. Oh yeah, that's the stuff. Then we'll get some of the this one, I guess. Sure. Yeah, look at this. And then we'll get some of this one. Hmm. Okay. I mean, it definitely looks way more leafy now. Did that do anything? I feel like that doesn't do anything. No, it doesn't. Okay. <laughs> it looks good though. Okay, so... Still working on that campus attractiveness. Why am I finding this so tough? It's probably really easy. Let's just get more buildings. Do you want another... F I don't want to... The problem here... Here's my problem. Using the same buildings over and over again just looks dumb, you know? I don't mind it, but if it didn't look so repetitive... Like, also, why do we have one section of key here? <laughs> We're gonna have a key, shouldn't we just have to make it longer? Uh... In that case, I think I... Wait, where, where, where do I find keys? Why can't I... Oh, they are in here. Which one is that? That's the one with a fence that looks like that, which I think is... This one. Yeah, cool. I was gonna... I think... I was gonna say, I'm pretty sure it rotates the fence depending on which way the land is. Okay, so let's go to here. Then all of this, I'm just gonna... Whoops. Level out to the same height, probably, as this. Oh, actually, you know what? This is a different one. That's slightly annoying. So I think I used the dirty one, and then that's like a clean one. Can we upgrade between them? Because that'd be, that'd be useful. So there's fenced, and then there's fenced. And I think this is the one I used. <sighs> Alright. <laughs> I think I used this one instead, because there's one that's like got the sort of water texture on it, the other one doesn't. Go down here. I'm gonna just do that. Let's go all the way along this time instead. Yeah, that works. Okay. Then we're gonna select all of this. Do the exact same thing all over again. Hooray! Okay. Campus attractiveness, did that help us out? 1506. Yeah, see, doing that helps us out a lot. And all these sort of park things, I guess, which I guess, I mean, it makes sense, but also it's kind of annoying because I don't wanna have to put parks everywhere. They're all like the same, though, too. That's. <laughs> This is the problem. Like, now we just got that again, which we have like 50 of those around the place. We got another one over there. We got one there, one there, one over here somewhere as well, don't we? Oh no, we didn't put one over here. Oh yeah, let's get one over here. Sweet. <laughs> get another one of these over here. Hell yeah, where should we put it? Maybe, oh, can you go in here? Oh yeah, it can. Yeah, there we go. Now this is a campus area. 1656. Wait, how long till the end of the school year? We're in May. Okay, so if we do have a couple more things. We got the space here too. Let's get another statue in here. Let's statch up. <laughs> statch up. Uh, let's do this one again. This little fountain, maybe. Like that. And then... So dumb. <laughs> uh, okay, let's have a look. 1706. Here we go. And then maybe another statue next to it. And we should be good. We should be level 5. Oh, that's another fountain. Well, you know, that probably works too. Let's have a look. Uh, 1756? Oh, come on. All right, fine. One more statue. Wait, is this even a statue? I don't even know what it is. Oh, it is. This is statue one. And I bet as soon as we like level up, there'll be a bunch of other buildings that we can use instead that look way better. But whatever. Okay. So we got a bunch of those everywhere. It is now over the threshold to actually level up. So there we go. Uh, I mean, I guess I could have done free education for a while, but I don't want to spend money on that. All right, so this school should be pretty, pretty pumping now. I'm pretty happy about that. Let's go to the park, and we'll work on this while that, that school's going on. So this is just a regular city park, so why don't we see what we can do with that? Uh, let's go into here. Have a look at a couple of things that we could do. <laughs> a park pier into the lake. I mean, to be fair, why not? I guess you can go out here and check out the lake. It looks kind of sad, because these trees there are dead. Uh, let's get rid of the dead trees, because it looks really bad. Why is that all? D did I paint that? Is that what I, that is? Or is that, um, no, let me make this. What is this? No, it's just, uh, because if I painted it, oh, hang on. Oh, that's nothing. If I painted it, it would look like that. Then I can get rid of it and it goes back to that. Okay. But is it this paint in here? 
Is it like sand? I don't think so because it's also not going away. Because that's sand. Okay. Did it just like flood up to that level at some point? Or is it polluted here? What's going on? Why is this weird? I don't know. I really don't know why that whole section there is like that. Anyway, whatever. Let's go back to doing this. Uh, okay, so what we need... Just the entertainment value just needs to be lifted up a bit more. That's alright, we'll make this park super entertaining. Let's get a park cafe. I feel like, do we have some of these already? I don't know, but we'll get one near the campus because it just makes sense. Can we do it like right on the... I mean, it could probably just go here, but I guess we want people to pay money to go to these places as well. You know, so we'll put it there. Maybe get a restroom just opposite it. Right there. Should we get some chess boards? That's pretty cool. Seems like a really campusy thing to do. I guess. <laughs> I, I guess. Uh, oh, that's a weird place to put that. I mean, I think it's a weird place to put this chessboard anywhere. But whatever. I'll go there. That's nice. Alright, how are we looking now for entertainment? 401 out of 420? Damn, this is an entertaining park, man. Let's get out, uh, should we get another park pier? Oh yeah, get a couple of park piers up in here. Yeah, check out this sweet lake, guys. You can come out. I mean, to be fair, that would be pretty nice. Alright, so this is leveled up. That's great. <laughs> that's actually pretty good. Uh, it's really not hard to level it up. We just gotta put a bunch of stuff in it. Okay, and then we gotta get some gazebos, because it'd be, you know, it'd be pretty dumb if we didn't get gazebos, right? Let's so, say, you know, don't, don't be silly. Um, get one out here, maybe. One, rotate around to this pathway. Good, this is the gazebo, gazebo county, you know? So that's kind of what we're doing over here. It's like, this is where, if you want to go get a gazebo and do some, some study. I mean, that actually doesn't look too bad. I thought it was going to look kind of dumb, but I think it kind of works, to be fair. Uh, 686 out of 720. Actually, almost nearly at the next level, too. I want to get trampolines. Trampolines are so dumb to me. Like, why would I do that? Park info booth. That also is like, why would I do that? How about we get a little plaza? That makes sense. We could do that over here near all this stuff. If we do it here, and then I'll sort of like line it up to the, the road. Because that to me makes sense, because then it looks like it's on the road rather than in the park. Uh, oh, hey, we reached uh, level four. It's the first time we ever did it, so we have a new thing. The climbing frame for all the kids that are going to be coming to this park. Uh, so this park is this area. Okay. These guys basically live in the park. That's pretty cool. You got a good house there, guys. I hope you're, I hope you're happy with that. Uh, and then we're going to go for... You know what? I'm going to get a climbing frame in here. Why not? We'll get a little playground area. We'll do that over this side. This is kind of where all the, the facilities are, so I feel like it kind of makes sense over here. Maybe we should do a park info booth as well, just so it's kind of like... You know, it all goes together. We'll do it on the road, maybe, so it's like you can get info before you go into the park so you don't have to pay for it. Maybe get some more gazebos, more gazebo county... I was about to say gazebo county USA, but it doesn't really make sense because it's supposed to be a European map. Oh, yeah. I actually, I actually like that. Maybe we should do another se section of gazebos over here. Let's do the red gazebos over here. Yeah. Here we go. So we're going to go like this. Gazebo. Gazebo. <laughs> Place them on a pathway. It's a little bit easier sometimes. Uh, ooh, come on, right. So the rotator is so weird. You have to like right click and drag. So then you're sort of like moving the mouse, and then it's like snapping to more stuff as you do that. So weird. On there. All right, how's that? A little another gazebo, gazebo county. It's a pretty cool park. I mean, it, it's it's supposed to be a park for the university. Is kind of what I'm imagining it, it as. Um, oh wait, so this this is top level. Oh, we, I guess we finished it. Well, let's, should we boost the, the, the ticket price? 25? Hell yeah. Policies. Oh, we can do policies. Um, animal ethics. Well, it's not a zoo. Advertisement campaign, main park, fine for fireworks, celebrate. No. Night tours? No. Even more fun? No. Recycle guy? We can recycle. Let's do that. How much does that cost? 10 per, 10 per nature reserve building. Oh. It's nature reserves. Okay, well then let's not do that. That doesn't do anything. Okay, stop. <laughs> it doesn't do anything for us, who cares? Alright, Brook Meadows is great. Uh, what is the name of this college, anyway? Linden College of Liberal Arts. I feel like we never named that. We probably didn't, so I'm not surprised. Uh, okay, so we finally finished, well, hopefully once this levels up. Uh, this is finally level 5. Then we should start the other campus. Now, I think we were talking about this before, about where we should do another campus and all that. Um, and I think some of you guys suggested that we should do one... Oh, actually, well, hang on. We still need the faculty for this campus, which we don't know. How big is that going to be? That's going to be real big, right? It probably will be. It'll probably be massive. So we'll have to figure out where that can go soon, as soon as we get it. So let's fast forward a little bit. In the meantime, so that's kind of the size of a campus. 
probably could fit. I was thinking along here, but I kind of think this should just still be like residential and commercial, all this kind of stuff. Uh, the other idea was uh, for you guys, you suggested we do it on another island somewhere. Uh, let me have a look like this. Is there like one that's kind of like a nice size that would be like a good size just for a campus? <laughs> here by the nuclear power plant. Because I was like, I would love to do it on its own island. Like the campus just has its whole, a whole island itself. But they're all pretty damn big. I mean, maybe that one over there. Um, well, how much is it to buy? Because these tiles are going to get expensive. 106000 just to buy tiles now. I mean, we could just do... We kind of act... The, pro the problem was, we, we accidentally did unlock all at one point. Um, so that's how we kind of ended up getting a bunch of stuff. And then now it's just meant that this is all... Ex I mean, we have like 7 million. It's probably fine, right? Just buy... Let's buy out over this way, because I think we- I want to expand this way anyway, because this is where the other cool islands are, across the, uh, the water here. Yeah, it's really expensive, but I don't- it's not like we pay maintenance on this stuff, right? When I buy tiles. I don't know, as long as I don't make myself go broke, then we're good. Right? Right, guys? <laughs> get out of here. I'll get out this line here as well. How much am I- I got 4.8, okay. We should be fine. Let's get that for now, let's have a look. Okay, so now we can sort of actually move the camera over here. I mean, this is a pretty desolate island. We could make it look more green anyway, but that could be a good destination campus location. Or over here, we've actually got a highway connection right here, uh, which I don't even... Where, where would that even go? I guess you could have a highway that comes up here and joins up over here somewhere, but then it's like, what's the point? Maybe this highway could actually run along here. Down. Just trying to see the shortest bridge, bridge across here, maybe. Come across this island. Maybe tunnel so ships can still get through or something. Do like a little cool tunnel there. Come across here. We could do a highway, I guess. That would work. Uh, and then... Um, well, actually, hang on. Let's have, what, what is... How is everything else going, by the way? We've kind of left everything else by the wayside as we've been doing stuff. So we've got... What do I want to look at? Public transport. I think is good. I mean, we got a we got a lot of lines going on. I guess the train is probably something else I want to keep a keep an eye on, because we definitely want to extend the train lines as well. I do like them. I, I love the central station, but it was always a problem being here, just because it has so many tracks, um, and we're trying we're trying to use all of them. It's hard, but we're sort of we're getting there. We've got a few more that we haven't used. That one's actually being used by regional trains, so that's really good. I mean, we could use a couple more. We just have to do tunnels to get to places. Uh, and actually, how is this going now? It's still, it's still busy here, but I think, and what I'm hoping is that vehicles going this way now are not coming from over here. And it looks like they're not. So that's really, really good. We have people coming from here for some reason. Oh, you know what? It's because we don't have any trains here. That's why they're coming from here. So if we get some train, cargo trains around here somewhere for this whole area it would be good. And then probably these guys too. They have a train line like right here that we could use. So we should probably do, get on that. And there's a station over there. The thing is, we should maybe we should just build a road that goes over here because if they wanted to ship, they could just drive here. But if they want to drive there, they either have to go down here. Well, actually, they have to drive down here onto the highway, up around, down here, down here, across like that. Or if they go the other way, they have to go through down here, come off over here. Or actually, I think you can come this way too. But like, it's so far away. So I think. I think I should change this into a roundabout, because I, I remember, well, when I built this last time, I said this is really dumb and I overdid it. And I, I totally did. So let's just, let's just change this into a regular intersection. I don't know why, actually no, I do know why I paused, is because the game doesn't have a road now, which is a slight problem. So let's turn this into a roundabout, because uh, that will be fine. Let's check that on the ground. Uh, actually, no, let me rebuild that. Get rid of that. Get through here like that. And through there like that. Now let's have a look and make sure we don't have any weird things going on here. I think that's all good. Uh, I might just delete these lane assignments for now just because I'm not sure how this is all going to work out. Make sure we don't have any weird arrows. No, we're all good. So this is now going to be a two lane roundabout here. Okay, I can't. Why is it not popping up? Hello? Oh, there we go. Okay. Two lane roundabout. Uh, probably highway road, because I don't think anyone's going to be walking down this way. So let's do a two lane highway. Uh, and then we'll see. We don't need to keep that open. And it's a good size. That's probably fine. So let's try that out. And then we'll just do a quick uh, go around where we have the left lane is always the exit lane. The middle one keeps going around. So let's do that just so they get in the lane they need to be in. And then they should all still have... 
Uh, they can all enter, which is sometimes a little dangerous, but we'll see how we go. Anyway, let's have a look. So this road, I think I might even just make that a few less lanes. I don't think it needs to be four lanes like that. Probably not. Now, this needs to go over this rail. So, let's go... Well, you know what? Let's just do this. I'm going to go like this and then just level this road off and then we'll just make a bridge to where it needs to go. So we'll go up and that will go about there. Obviously, that looks ridiculous at the moment. So we're going to bring that in closer to about there. Bring this one in closer to about there. And then that can be raised up too because that looks silly. And we've just deleted the power lines, which is fine. We'll fix that in a minute. And we'll do maybe a slope. Okay, so that goes like that. Let's get rid of that because that's broken now. Let's just go just down here a little bit. Okay, so that road will now come over here. And I can unpause as well now that we've got that road built back in. And this will basically just join straight up to... Hmm, which road would be best? Maybe the main road over there. So like this one there, just because that can then... If they want to just drive all the way through, they could do that. And if they wanted to go up there, they could go through. Let, well, let's see how that goes. Re really, let's just see how that goes. If it works, it works. If not, we can sort of have a look at it. Now, I don't like when they do stuff like this where they change lanes in the middle of the roundabout because I feel like they don't need to do that. All they have to do is get in the correct lane when they jump on the roundabout like they are now. And then they'll go to where they need to go instead of all... Because otherwise they're all pile in one lane and don't use multiple lanes. But this should hopefully work just fine, uh, is the theory. <laughs> the, the theory is that it'll work. In practice, I don't know. But we'll, we'll have a look. Anyway, it seems to be okay so far, so that's good. Uh, it's going to be heavy traffic through here, of course. I wouldn't be surprised. I'm not surprised by that at all because we have that huge interchange right here. So, of course. Uh, and then that now connects up here. So these guys might even start preferring coming this way rather than the old way that they had to go, which was down through here. Which is actually good because that means we'll probably start drawing vehicles away from this area, which is just awful. Just awful, awful, awful. Uh, so that's good. I don't know. I honestly don't know why I didn't do that before because, I mean, look how many people are already using this road. Uh... Do we have more? Oh, hang on, actually. You know what? This might have caused an issue. Because we now have a lot of people coming off the highway going through here. Oh, I see the issue. Okay, so what we've just done is a good and a bad thing. Hey, look, we're prestigious now. We also lost a number of students, but we are prestigious. We've got a bunch of new buildings to have a look at in just a second. We've got the Art Gallery, School of Economics, Liberal Arts Media Lab, Dance Club, Academic Statue 2. Good. Can we please change those now? <laughs> Can we change those so we don't have the same one everywhere? Uh, yeah, so what I've done is I've basically just created a highway route through here. Uh, which is absolutely not what I want to do. So I'm thinking, can we just go... Can this be... Have a policy of no through traffic? Uh, which one is that? It's Is it Old Town? Uh, only residents and businesses can use the area for motor uh, vehicles. Ban other motor traffic. Yeah. So I think if we do that... That'll hopefully stop people driving through here instead of using the highway. Because we want, obviously, everyone that's just going on the highway to stay up here and come around. So hopefully they'll do that. Because uh, we, we don't want the entirety of the highway traffic coming this way. The other way we could do it is just slowing this road down. That will probably help us out too. So let's also do that. We won't go too slow because that would just be silly if we did. We'll go down to 60. Because I think this one's 50. Then it goes to 100 because that is like a highway road. This one is 50, then it goes 70. Oh, I guess because, you know what, because I, I updated all these roads, didn't I? So let's change those. Those should be 70. Should this be 70? No, we'll leave that as 100. That's fine. Uh, and then this is 50. That's okay. That's okay. <laughs> let's go down to 40. <laughs> I don't know why. That's okay. All right, that's 40. This one's 70. I'm okay with that road being 70 because that's what we set it as. It's 70 all the way through, which is nice, except for this bit when it gets down to the town, which is fine. Um, okay, so now let's just have a look at this traffic because that should that should have completely stopped people going all the way through. Uh, there's still a few, but that might have just been the leftovers from before. Uh, let's have a look here. Cool, absolutely no one is driving down this way and going left, uh, which is odd. Can they like not go left or just no one wants to go left? <laughs> uh, does no one want to go left from here? Because no one's going left. Or are they now going down this way? Is that what they're doing? Yeah, they, they're... Okay. I think that's also why I had this down to here. Because I think I did the same thing. Okay. 
because they're now using this as the highway instead of that road. <laughs> okay, that's a slight issue with having all these... The thing is, again, and I think I said this before a while ago, is like when we build this area up and the, uh, there's way more intersections, they will prefer to use the highway anyway. But because right now it's quicker to go that way, that's what they're doing. Uh, so let's have a look now. That should have changed that thing. Yeah, there we go. Now they're all going that way instead, which is good. Yeah, okay. They're, go they're, they're back going that way. They're like, damn it, they got rid of our shortcut. That was the best shortcut ever. All right, that should... Uh, Hopefully get a more realistic selection of traffic using this area, how it should be used, which is good. Uh, and then that should all be looking nice and neat. All right, well, I'm going to leave this part here. Uh, well, no, I'm not. Sorry, that's a lie. I, I just remember, I was about to say, I'm going to leave it here, but we did all this stuff to get the new building, but I haven't even used it. All right, School of Economics. Now, I'm wondering, can we just de-level this area? Like, can we just get rid of some of these things now? Like, can I get rid of all the duplicates that I put everywhere? Like, we're- well, I don't mind the cafeteria. Like, can I get rid of this? That'll probably be fine, right? If I pause. Let's, have, let's pause and sort of organize this. So if I've gotten rid of that now... It's still 1806, but it might be because I'm paused. Let's have a look. That should... update, but it didn't, so I don't know. Anyway, whatever. Let's get the School of Economics. So I think if we go this way... I've kind of- you can see I overlapped this a little bit, but that's fine. I'm gonna get rid of that pathway. Uh, whoa, okay, that's got a really big berth on it. Uh, so, sorry, is it weird having it here next to the uh, the high school as well? It's a kind of a weird spot for it, isn't it? I mean, I guess it's fine. It's kind of just encompassed this whole area. Uh, this is kind of, okay, why is it kind of snapping? I'm trying to not destroy the uh, the river that we have there, but it's kind of hard. Because that's as far, this is as far left as I can go here. I guess it's fine. School of Economics. You can take 1,300 students. Oh my gosh. Alright, so if we put that there, we still have the high school here, which... I mean... I guess it could just be part of the Liberal Arts College. Like, maybe it's only, like, the college years of high school. Like, so, like, what, 10, 11, 12, or 11, 12, or whatever. Uh, and then maybe it's just part of it. I don't know. I don't know. That's apparently what we're doing. So that's cool. Alright, so what other buildings did we get that were new? We got the uh, new statue, the statue 2. So let's go get rid of some of the statue 1s. Let's get rid of that one. Uh, we got two of the same fountains over there. It's so dumb. Uh, let's get the statue 2. Oh, yeah, statue 2. Here we go. Mmm. So look at that. Yeah, there we go. Statue 2. <laughs> Alright, then let's also get... What else is new? We got the, uh, the dance club. Was that new? The, yeah, I think all of these ones here are new. Not the bookstore, the, uh, so the media lab uh, can go probably down here. There actually seems to be quite a bit of space for it. Or maybe we'll get rid of some of these. <laughs> get rid of some of these fountains that we put everywhere just to level up because it looks so stupid. All right, then we get the, was that media lab? Oh, this actually fits kind of well, I think. Put it here on this corner. Has parking. Well, maybe it doesn't fit too well there. Let's move that. Uh, maybe here maybe in this section? Yeah, and this corner actually might work quite well. Maybe. Kind of intersects those houses there, but... Let's level it down to there, too. I mean, that's okay. It's kind of like... Because this road is dipping down so much, it looks kind of bad on that side. I guess what I can do is maybe bring the whole thing down a bit. Like that. Mm. It's a little rough, but it, you know, it'll do. You know, it'll do. There's probably a better spot for that, though. Especially, you know, if we get... Well, I don't think it would fit here. Uh, just trying to see where else it could go. Maybe back here, because we got a lot of duplicate buildings back here, too. Let me get rid of that, and get rid of this, and get rid of that. And what's this? Move this. Move that back to here. And then let's move this over here, because that building is too... I think it's just too big to fit over there is the problem. So get the media lab over here instead. That'll be better. Yeah, it's much nicer, because it's actually flat over here, and it actually fits. Who would have thought that it would look better there? And the dance club, maybe that can go over here, or that can go... ...over this way, maybe in this section of the school. Little dance club back over here. It always looks weird when they have parking spots though, and they're nowhere near a road, so... ...maybe we should move it back over this way. Because we've got room... I mean, this whole road here where we were just before has room, so when we put it here... There you go, little dance club. Level that down to the road height. Level that down to the road height. There you go. Except the cars are floating, so that's a little awkward. Is that something I can fix or no? <laughs> is, that, is that gonna get fixed or no? I think if I do that... Oh no, I think it did fix itself. Cool. 
let's move that there you go beautiful all right so that's gonna go there uh and then was there anything else can i see the results of the academic year report oh yeah here we go okay so we did economics we did that we did that we did that oh the art gallery where's that oh is that actually no that's one of the museums isn't it so i think we've unlocked the museum now for it which i guess d this doesn't need it this can be can only be placed once can be placed anywhere in the city okay well let's not rush to place this so we've got a museum i guess we've got to come up with a museum district which could be like down here could be quite nice or around here somewhere maybe so i don't know let me know in the comments down below uh and then maybe what we'll do next time as well is maybe level up this park that's kind of sad you guys wanted to see more parks up as well and maybe this nature reserve too we'll start leveling some of those up and building more parks because we need to do that too uh, we still got a lot of space as well, so just like that we previously built that we haven't really filled in. So anyway, let me know in the comments down below uh, what you want to see next. We've done some campus stuff. Finally, it's finally expanded and filled this area, which I think looks way better now because it's actually filled up that whole space, which it was supposed to a long time ago. So that's great. But thanks for watching, guys. I will see you next time and have an awesome day.